years ago, God put on my heart to launch a HR consulting firm to take everything that we've developed for these bigger companies and take it to smaller companies. And that's what we did. We launched in his name HR about 12 years ago. So originally, Chuck, when we launched, we thought, well, we have all these high performance HR practices that we can bring to the small guy. But how do we segue it into kingdom minded organizations, faithful organizations? You know, we have a lot of Mennonite Amish folks in Lancaster County, and they do feel uh, that, you know, a big part of their lives is integrating faith within the culture. Uh, what's God doing with you now? So what God's doing now is about uh, six years ago, a good friend of mine working uh, at Lancaster Bible College said, hey, Mark, ABHE, which is an accreditation agency over all the Bible colleges, they have, have I, I believe, um, over 250 colleges, 183 to 200 colleges that they accredit. Uh, John said, hey, Mark, they really need your help. Uh, HR practices are really behind. So we partnered with ABHE, and as a result, we've supported uh, colleges all over the United States with their HR practices. But recently, what God's put on our heart is, how do we connect the students that are graduating? You know, they literally have over 58,000 students under ABHE. And another organization we partnered with is Trax. They have over 27,000 students. And we thought, what, what can we do to help grow and prosper the students? So we've used all our human resources experience. Uh, we wrote a book, um, College to Career, The Student's Guide to Career Navigation. It's 12, 12 chapters. We interview experts in the marketplace. And those books have been provided with blessed all the career centers at ABHE with all those books, with the syllabus. And then also as a result of the relationship with these organizations, we launched a job portal called Job Shepherd. And the vision is to be the indeed of Christianity over a sustained period of time. So we've invited all employers, whether they're religious, non-exempt, like a Christian college or a church or a ministry, or Christian for-profit businesses to post their vacancies for free. We're literally doing it for free until the website uh, scales. It could take some time to scale. I've been a Pinnacle Forums member now uh, a little bit over six months, and it has made an incredible impact on me. Uh, the, the, the men that are in, in, the, in my group saw my background, saw the input I was giving uh, to, to the Forums group, and said, Mark, you need to take all that and take it to a whole new level. You need to write another book. I've written two other books, but they thought you should take a book for these times and, and, and create it. So I'm excited to, to announce Faith Driven HR, Faith Driven Human Resources will be a book that we're, we're currently working on. We have a commitment from Brady Pyle. He's retired for the NASA Johnson Space Center. Brady's gonna be interviewed in the book to talk about how you can live out your faith as a Christian in a, in, in a secular environment, in a government institution. Christians now more than ever are afraid to live out their faith. Brady's gonna give encouragement. We're also gonna have chapters for entrepreneurs, for students, for HR directors, for business owners. And we're gonna be interviewing some amazing thought leaders, not just Brady, uh, but other folks as well thought leaders that you're going to know their names. So we're praying they continue to have interest in the book and that we can announce who those thought leaders will be in the next coming weeks. When can we look for that? We can look for that book by fall. So your company is also um, on on your website, In His Name HR. Yes. Uh, you're offering uh, diversity, equity, inclusivity training. Yes, we, we, we are. We've been requested to create the training to fill a void because there's many for-profit Christian-owned businesses and many religious exempt employers that are looking for an alternative to what's currently available. We take the training, we do it from a biblical perspective and make sure that it's uplifting, creates human connectedness and is really focused on the strengths of the ind individual rather than a training that's negative or, or or tears people down we want something that's uplifting 
and we're working on like a blog article that we could share uh, w w with folks about the uh, the black and Caucasian perspective of DEI and how well, we can grow and develop from that. So if people would like to know more or they just like to contact you just to say hi and, and get to know you a little sure. bit better, how could they reach out to you? In his name, HR.com. We have a contact form there. Really easy. You can contact us there. We're out on Twitter. Uh, you could send a direct message through Twitter. Um, it, it's real easy to get a hold of us and look for links in the description to this video. I'm sure we'll have contact information there as well. Well, that's Pinnacle Forum partner, Mark Griffith, hard at work uh, uh, stewarding the influence that God has given him. Thank and you. for more information, listen to the podcast. There's a button right yes. below. Thanks. God bless. Thank you, Chuck.